friends always knew Komi Nuglozi had an eye for fashion design. Every time we go somewhere, they say, oh, you like to dress up. You, you need to be a designer. Be a designer and create some clothes for us. And he started like that. His business started in his homeland of Togo in West Africa. In 18 years old, I started to do the sewing, create some stuff, and travel all of the West Africa and sell it there. Five years ago, Comey brought his passion for fashion to downtown Portland with Nokosi Boutique. I'm trying to use African fabric to uh, adapt uh, to the regular clothes everybody can wear. He makes custom one-of-a-kind pieces and also sells jewelry made in Togo. This year, his business suffered a tough setback. In the span of a few months, the store was broken into and vandalized three times, causing thousands of dollars in damage. Those things are making me uh, say like, oh, downtown right now is uh, difficult to have a business. Yeah. Comey switched gears during the pandemic and started sewing face masks to survive. He is excited about the opportunity to sell at the Northwest Made Holiday Market. It's an annual event to shop and support local businesses. This year, because of COVID, it will take place entirely online. We have developed a, a whole new platform that's never been done before. It's basically like an Amazon for small local businesses. Michelle Reed is with Mercy Corps Northwest, the group hosting the event, centering around local women and BIPOC entrepreneurs. This year, 60 small businesses from the Portland area are featured. We're really hoping that um, this market can help boost sales for small businesses during the holiday season, um, especially during these pandemic times when no in-person holiday markets will be happening. So we're just trying to give them all a platform to sell their, to sell their goods. Goods for sale include food, crafts, beauty products, and Comey's designs. And my idea is if you, everything is going well, I'm going to close and just uh, do the sewing uh, somewhere and have a line store. Comey, once fearful his business would close, is now hopeful the market can help it survive, even if it means taking his unique treasures online. The seventh annual Northwest Made Holiday Market is up and running right now and will last through December 30th. We have more information about it at KGW.com. In downtown Portland, Christelle Kumwe, KGW News.